welcome to 11th of April's Golly Basinga. Now, Supreme Father says that it is just a thought away. Yes, to receive his power, his love, his blessings is just a thought away. He has to just think and from his metaphysical form, non-physical form of energy and light, that ray of blessing comes down onto us. But are we yet? receiving it are we ready to receive it or are we even understanding how to receive it do we have that knowledge yes it's time to become soul conscious it's time to think of ourselves as an energy of metaphysical form so that the transfer of energy from metaphysical to metaphysical is easier from god to us the souls so here god says may you become full of powers and receive the drishti of love and mercy by having the awareness of mine Receive the drishti, drishti means the vision of love and mercy from whom the creator by having the awareness of mind. So God says, once the children recognize the father, that means once we have the revelation which has been mentioned even in the Christian religion and also has been mentioned in Bhagavad Gita that once he comes down, he gives us the knowledge of how to be revealed of who we are and who he is and then go into liberation so god says once the children recognize the father and from their hearts say my baba baba means father now father is not physical father father of the soul the one who gives knowledge bab dada the ocean of mercy looks at such children from where from top up above with spiritual love as a multi-million fold return multi-million fold you say just once and he gives you multi-million my baba this drishti of love and mercy constantly enables them to move forward that means you get the energy to move through the darkness of kaliuga through to move through the blessed lake where there's so many different forms of animals who are ready to carnivores that animals ready to eat you and he's the one who guides us protects us in all these pathways and he takes us or takes our complete boat across from the darkness into the light so god says this awareness of spiritual belonging becomes a blessing for such children to fill themselves with power the awareness of spiritual belonging that i am a soul spirit and i belong to the supreme spirit of soul Bhagavad doesn't then need to give blessings with words like the way we are listening over here with words he doesn't need to give it with words when you remember him in the Suprema board in Nirvan Dham and Param Dham automatically all his energy comes down and you can absorb it provided you are considering yourself to be a spark a metaphysical energy an infinite being as simple as that I'm a light receiving the light from the creator as simple as that with words blessings with words but all the children continue to be sustained with his subtle loving thoughts. Catch that word. Thoughts. It is his thoughts which are taking care of us. It is his thoughts which are connecting to us. It is his thoughts which are guiding us. It is his thoughts which are helping us. It is his thoughts which are protecting us. But conditions apply. Do you know how to catch his frequency? And that is what we learn in Pramukumaris. You two are most welcome to understand this beautiful knowledge. Om Shanti with this.